All right, hey guys, I want to give you guys a quick update on uh, some of the stuff that's been going on recently. Um, so the first thing is, is that, again, we're on a self-empowerment journey. Uh, it's been really, really incredible the last few months. Um, as maybe some of you guys know, maybe some of you don't know, um, I'm also a, a wrestler, a professional wrestler, training to make world and Olympic teams in the sport of wrestling. And, um, you know, the Olympic year is coming up, so that's kind of what my main and purpose and job is. But um, as a side hobby and as a side quest, I've been um, studying law, studying um, uh, astrology, uh, metaphysics, um, psychology, uh, etc. Just because it uh, stimulates my brain and it gets me in a good, feel-good mood. I, I like learning, I love educating myself about um, how the world works, the nature of reality. Uh, philosophy, etc. Um, the one big thing that I wanted to point out, and I think I'm going to put a link in the in the bio, is that uh, I wanted to start connecting with people. I want to start connecting with you guys, um, and just shorter consultations right now, just to find out what, where people are, what you're looking for, what you're needing, and then kind of um, start creating um, and developing some maps. Um, some lessons, lesson plans, uh, specific and particular to um, your guys' needs. And um, so I will be putting a Calendly, Calendly appointments up. Um, not next week because I'll be going to a, a United States wrestling camp team, um, a, a team camp next week. But, um, but the week after that, I'll be free. And so you'll be able to book uh, a consultation with me, a 15-minute consultation with me for free after that. And um, also, too, I will. I also started a blog, too. So if you guys ever want to check out um, maybe what I'm doing in my day, uh, just another venue, just another uh, space for looking at what I'm learning, um, maybe on a daily basis if you want to catch up and just, just see, you know, and again, Sometimes this road can be very lonely, and sometimes this road can feel uh, very difficult and hard. Um, I have my wonderful wife here to, to help me, and, and while um, that has been amazing, obviously having the, the grace of Creator has obviously been wonderful and has put us in a very wonderful space. Um, other than that, I want to say that I've been, I have been learning about uh, negotiable instruments. I've been learning, um, I've put a lot of uh, information, not information, but I've, I've done a lot of negotiable instruments. Um, had some success, had some uh, not successes. Um, so I'm kind of seeing how that plays out. And then once it, as it's kind of playing out, I, I think I can, I think I'll feel comfortable giving you guys an update on those types of things. Um, for the most part, the best thing that I can offer and say right now in my journey is that uh, there has to be a one uh, a willingness to stay and be in the present moment two there has to be a willingness to know and recognize the mechanisms of the mind the lower mind the ego uh, the self um, in this journey, it is a knowledge of you, of who you are, um, what your purpose is, what your mission is, what your goal is, and ultimately, uh, we're talking about the whole point of all this is, is the evolution uh, of your consciousness, of your consciousness and your awareness, so that you can start creating the life that you were meant to create, instead of um, creating a life based on unconscious programming patterns and thought systems. Um, that are rooted and based in victimhood. In light of that, uh, there is a lot of really brilliant uh, information out there that um, I learned. I'm sure that you're learning also too. Uh, but more importantly than getting information is um, alignment. Alignment is greater than information. If it's not aligned to what you're doing, if it's not aligned to your purpose, if it's not aligned to what um, you're, is speaking to your heart, what is bringing you uh, joy and peace 
what is causing you to transcend your limitations. If it's not doing any of those things, then it, you may not be in alignment um, with what you're supposed to be doing, and that's okay. Um, but that's a time to refocus, reanalyze where you are, and to um, connect back to source and um, and being directed. The mind, the ego, always is always has an answer, and those answers are always based upon the past, always. Um, or it's trying to project itself into the future because it cannot, it does not exist in the present. It cannot. Um, our ego, our thought systems, our way of being is all based upon survival with the lower mind. And oftentimes that survival in the lower mind is, again, like I said, based on a program of, that is victimhood. So, um, again, as we know ourselves, as you know the mind, as you know your true self and find awareness in the true self and realize that there are even higher awarenesses than, than even that awareness, um, I think that we'll come to find that uh, what we are experiencing here on earth is absolutely brilliant. It is brilliantly orchestrated. We're living in um, incredibly unprecedented times. And um, the fact that we get to participate in this life and this time uh, is absolutely incredible. So whether you're on a spiritual journey um, and you like my content for that reason, uh, whether or not you're on the sovereignty journey and you like learning about the discharging of debts and um, how to free yourself from the matrix system that is the government and the political systems and etc. Um, the most important part about this is that we live in gratitude knowing that um, all things are truly working out um, in perfect harmony according to our beliefs, according to our thought patterns, um, that the reality that we are living in and existing in is, uh, is a byproduct of our own inner state of being. So all that being said, I do appreciate uh, you guys for listening and um, I hope that uh, over the next coming months that this kind of relationship, my relationship with you guys, your relationship with me, gets um, a little more close, a little more intimate, um, that we get to really start seeing growth in our own lives. Ultimately, that's what it's all about. Evolution, growth, expansion, transcendence. Um, not that we de you know, look on, down upon uh, the limitations. Everything has its place, but um, that ultimately we, we do we can be able to learn and to grow so much love to you guys uh, I hope to see you on that next video